Hello everybody, Togala here with the whole FTOG crew. I'm gonna uh, <laughs> <laughs> start that again. Oh man, everybody's got gas today. <laughs> you know, I, I cannot believe nice the company I keep. Turn off server farting because apparently one of the mods adds a farting in this game. <laughs> Evilcraft. Uh, it's Evilcraft. Yes. Yeah. Oh man! Hey, you found your skin, Ren. Yeah, I got some clothes on. Let's go. All right, awesome. Hello, everybody. Togal here, and welcome to season four of FTOG. Um, gonna start with introducing everybody that's here today. Non Sanity doesn't need any introduction. Greetings. Yes, he oh, it's five a.m. for him, so it's we're really happy that he joined us again. <laughs> Renovate, TDC. Hey, dude. What up, dude? Uh, Link the killer. What up, Dragon? Hey, hey. Mistaken. Hello. Drop. Hello. Howdy, howdy. The duck hey, farmer hey. that needs to be slapped whenever I see him. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Brink the gamer and hey. Daddy the body. And hello, hello. A couple people couldn't join us here today that are going to join us either <clears throat> later today or in the upcoming days. Um, and I'm sure you guys know them also. And you can find them all down in the description. Now. Season 4, we are playing on Minecraft 1.10.2 and a mod pack that we put together ourselves. It's called Avant 3. Um, links are going to be pretty sure in everybody's description. Um, and you can check out all the mods and stuff. And lots of mods that we don't know yet. And it's getting dark. Oh, talk yeah. Quick. Talk yeah, quick. I was thinking to speak, to talk faster. No, nope, I'm going to wait until <laughs> all the spiders come. <laughs> So we are in a chaparral, and I guess we're gonna start chopping wood, right? Anybody Let's wanna add it. something or? Yeah. All right, everybody get a stone shovel first, and then kill Grok. That's uh, absolutely. For episode oh, yeah. one. <laughs> a couple things. We're gonna stick around spawn where everybody that wants to, like little houses on these hilltops. Um, it's pretty nice area, but eventually we wanna have a shopping district here. Because it'd be kind of cool. Instead of just a spawn town, I actually have some purpose here. I already know what I want to sell. Um, but that all depends on the live stream later. <laughs> I think uh, we're going to get a little bit of lag. Oh, uh, yeah. I can't do anything. Oh, do we have spawn protection? Oh. Yes, we do. Ah. ah. Lemons. Oh, God. Oh, I see a skeleton and a zombie. I don't think I can change that on the fly. I think I need to restart the server for that. We'll be right back, guys. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll be right back. Okay? <laughs> yes, that. <laughs> Good stuff. That's just perfect. That's fine. <laughs> it happens. I gotta do, add that to my list. I have a list of things to do, like... I made sure Morpheus has changed and stuff like that. But... Yeah, those are the things that you always forget every season, yeah. Yep. Ow. How can we break wood though if we can have a small bit of food? It's a you're okay. Yeah. I wasn't that far away. <laughs> Remember this is 10.1? Oh yeah. <coughs> so you can't spam click? One protection six. Yeah, Zero. That's going to be a big problem for people, getting used to the combat thing. I play on the vanilla stuff. Field equipped. <laughs> And another one with torches, and you can just switch between them. This is a massacre. Oh my god, it's baby zombies! Babies! <laughs> oh my god! Get it away from me! <laughs> what happens wow. to your stuff when you die? It goes in the grave? I don't see a grave. Oh, are you kidding me? I uh, in the baby. I just saw... Oh, oh, right... Oh. No, 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 no. Oh! <laughs> Jesus, it's kill it sounds like yeah, right, pigs right, being right. slaughtered. <laughs> Don't worry, only this someone makes the worst start of this series. <laughs> <laughs> I'm helping! I'm helping! Come here, Thor! I'm helping! What are you doing? <laughs> no, the baby uh, zombie's gonna kill the sheep. Come on, man. I don't like this baby zombie. Run my grave. What? I bet you Non hasn't even <gasps> logged in yet. Oh, there's lizards. I'm <laughs> here. You here? Okay, I was gonna say, I'm he's here. so quiet, he's probably still like, I'm not logging in until I hear these guys this morning. I was just running for my life. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't get a grave run? No, no, uh, I was in the wrong pond. Ah! Okay. Oh, 
Oh, I got some weird leather Dude, boots. These spawn scouts. Yeah, those uh, you can just put in your crafting window and you get leather scraps, and four leather scraps make a piece of leather. <laughs> yeah, I knew! <laughs> that skeleton avoided the hole. Oh, what's the difficulty on? Oh my god! Hard. I'm out. <laughs> Is it they yet? <laughs> oh. You only have five more hours of night time, don't worry about it. Ah, the worst part I think is that zombies don't get knocked back anymore. Oh. Uh, yep. Okay. Oh my okay. god, I'm this ready. place is like a major graveyard. Ah! Ah! I'm safe. How y'all doing? I was under a hole, oh, but... Uh, oh, this is oh where is my grave? We're, we're gonna watch this from up here, fellas. <laughs> I had so much gold and iron on me already, and I just died. You oh, had man. gold and iron? <laughs> yeah. I had diamonds. I, I had a loot chest. That I oh, I see sheep. Why don't we kill the sheep? Where'd you find a loot chest? Um, off toward... Oh, three of them! Looks like the west. Oh, so you, you just left us all here? <laughs> you like? I'm out of here. How's it going, Ren? You gotta come up higher. Gun's coming up. Skellies. They can see you from here. Oh yeah. A damaged leather belt. It's, it's kind of funny seeing. Oh my god. Wee! <laughs> Dragon running for his life. We, we gotta try to get some wool going, otherwise <laughs> it's gonna keep raining. Nothing's gonna despawn. Alright, I got one I piece of wool. I have one yeah. piece of wool as well, so we can now... Uh, now we just need to find another one. Oh my god! <laughs> really? baby <laughs> Uh, those suck so bad! I just really... Especially when they're in grass, because you keep breaking the grass instead of hitting them. <sighs> Great start, guys. Maybe, maybe I should. Uh, it was because. That would have been amusing. I did suggest it. I blame Thorgal, he, he talked too long. Hashtag. Hash blame. Hash, hash blame. Yeah, hash blame. <laughs> diggy diggy hole. Did you see bit it? Ah ah. No, you don't. Okay, you got so us up there spectating the whole thing. Yeah, I got tired of Wait, I'm dying. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not even sure how I died that last time. I was in the water, I was in a hole, and all of a sudden I just died. Really? You guys at the top should lay down some MLG commentary. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's Grok running really fast from a big zombie, <laughs> and he is going to die. Correct. He is dead. Right behind you, Duck Hunter! Duck Farmer, whatever you are! <laughs> <laughs> uh, it looks like it's much safer. I think I'm Ooh, I got gonna go down. I see uh, an explosion orb by TDC. Oh no, it's another big Oh man! Dra Dragon is slapping the zombie with his own flesh. <laughs> Brinks, great hey, robbing. Hey, me to have it. I'm not grog. The brain. <laughs> This place is a graveyard. I'm where is, yes, place. but where is my grave? That's the question. Oh, Follow okay. the beacon. Yeah, it's daytime, but it's still raining, so it's going to be a while. Somebody make an umbrella. <laughs> I got an iron sword. I got a stone sword. Alright guys, so after all that excitement at spawn, I did all sorts of things and I have sort of decided I might possibly settle in this place and have built myself the traditional hole in the ground. So this is a kind of cool uh, biome, not found anywhere else. It's called the Managlin. Managlin, possibly. Yes, Managlin. Uh, it comes from a special mode and it's filled with these trees that seem to glow in the dark. Lovely. 
Oh, and somebody slept. Excellent. We still have plenty of people on. Now, it's a little bit stupid because I was just going to come exploring. And I left a whole lot of stuff in the hole I made for myself at spawn. So I haven't. I'm going to have to go back and get the stuff. But really, I just want to get some minerals and things. Oh my god, I thought I cleared that space. And also made a sm make a smeltery and uh, a forge. I did make these things. But, you know, clearly a forge is needed. Oh, will you shut up? I thought I went through here. And I thought I lit the whole place up. So none of those noisy, evil creatures are going to disturb my peace. And as you can see, I sort of started decorating the walls. But clearly I didn't carry it through because, you know, boredom. Uh, what did I want to show you? Oh, yes. I went around and I explored a heck of a lot of... Uh, I, a couple of villages, a couple of desert... Uh, desert temples, I looted and I looted and I looted. I found those red runes, etc. from Quark. I have absolutely no idea what Quark is all about. But I found some very exciting things. Let's see, where are we? Where is the excitement? Ah, yes, the sprouts. There's a from agricultural expansion. And I have more of these at spawn. I just didn't bring them all. We have the glowstone sprouts. The diamond sprout, the guardian sprout, redstone, lapis, and skeleton. I think at spawn I have the emerald. Oh, I also found the wither one. Now that has got to be exciting, don't you think? Ah, uh, let's see. What does the what does this do? Ah, this is how you make the sheep sprout, which I have anyway. You get the resource sprout. So, you obtain this from resource crop, very nice. And if you heat it up, cooked mop chunk, okay, I don't want to cook it. If you craft it. All right, but what does this give me? Mashed food, excellent, from actually editions. And that's all? Ah, surely there's got to be something better. Well, I tell you what. I am going to go and plan these things. Is it day? It is day. It's an interesting sort of cyan sky that we have here. And I quite like the flowers. I think if I'm going, when I end up building a house, I will build it sort of higher up so I can look down on this area. Ah, uh, yes, I've prepared some, some place here. So, guardian sprout. Well, I'll just, I think you can't right click these. I think I heard uh, Thor saying that you couldn't right click them. So it doesn't really matter where I put them. Because... I am going to be, and um, this is squid, yes. Now, <laughs> what I'm hoping of, what I'm hoping is that they will give me, you know, bones and, uh, bones and diamonds, etc., etc., or at least something that will be eventually be made into bones and diamonds, etc. I caught a couple of cows at spawn, there are all these sheep there, but I don't really feel like catching more animals at the moment. Oh, Link was slain by Enderman. Uh, Thor was saying that, let's see. Oh, never mind. Thor was saying that if you... Uh, <laughs> that if you st that the standing bin b underneath two blocks you know, so something that has the two block height for an enderman doesn't work anymore. Apparently, the clever things will teleport you to them. And I think it's Quark that adds this, um, I think it's Quark that adds this 
functionality which I'm not sure I like it but never mind all right I tell you what I am going to go and mine for an hour now oh and again he's dead I'm going to mine for an hour oh something now this is marble I really like this marble but something that's quite cool in here I wanted to show you is that we get clay sort of in the as we mine underground which is so nice and it's gonna make getting the um it's gonna make getting a smeltery much easier yes iron oh those iron tools are horrific they break so quickly i really need to go into tinkers all right so anyway as i said i am going to mine and mine and mine and i will see you after an hour to show you how much i've managed to get hello again guys uh it's been quite a while in fact it's the next day now and i've opened the window and there are loud cars outside it oh wow anyway and there's a zombie the zombies are driving me mad and i lit up a cave outside of this room so do not have them but clearly i did light it up well enough anyway i did some stuff oh let me show you the resources Ah, uh, so, well, I didn't get much stuff out of the resource seeds, but they are so pretty. They are so excellent. Oh, so, well, let me show them out to you outside. I planted them all. So yesterday, yesterday, I think I played for about five hours. And I did a lot of exploring. Uh, so I went through a few villages, I think maybe three villages, and a couple of desert temples. And all the seeds that I have planted here, I'm really going to have to... Well, this this whole place is very temporary. It's just to give us a hole in the ground to get started. But, um, yeah, I planted all of these. And they are fantastic. Now, you can't try to click them, which is a pity. But, look, we get inks, <laughs> we get squid sprouts. So, we get squid essence, emerald essence sheep sprouts so the sheep essence will do will give us wool or sheep meat well basically there appears to be an essence for everything in the game let me just quickly replant these and the other pretty fantastic thing about them is that sometimes you get an extra sprout not this time obviously with our spider crop, I, sh I will gather them all, but not quite nether crop. So from these, I think you can make netherrack or uh, guardian crop. Look at this, guardian essence. So prismarine shards and crystals. User joined your channel. Now, and I think now this is the spider crop. What is my favorite one? I want to show you my favorite one the weather crop ah look at this oh where did where did it go did i break something or was there nothing here i don't know but anyway weather essence look at what it does and all of these you can make yourself. You start with a resource seed, which you can craft like this. And if I collected a lot of these, I would get um, some better essences. Ah, uh, let's see. So how would I get a wither, wither sprout? So I need the powerful sprout and the ultimate sprout, which I get, and I get I need a chunk of wither, which I get from killing it wither. And these drop with low efficiency out of these crops. 
so I could make all of these plants myself. But obviously, finding them in a um, in dungeon chest is just brilliant. I mean, just think of it. I might actually be able to get the three wither skulls before ever stepping foot in the nether. Possibly not, because all of this is going very slowly, but, you know, it's definitely a legitimate way of generating the stuff. Okay, so this is one thing I did. Now, the other stuff I did might surprise you somewhat, because with all these new mods to play with, I went into two, two mods that are, that are very old and I feel safe with. But it's not that I don't want to try out the new mods, but I really, really want to learn to fly. Oh, not maybe perfect flight, but just anything, because walking around exploring this place is very slow. And one thing I haven't found yet is a rogue dungeon, and I would really like to find... Mm -hmm. I would really like to find uh, rogue dungeons. So, flight. And clearly the way I've always gotten early flight is with a combination of dark steel armor from Ender.io and Lutania. So I made a sagmel and an alloy smelter. And I made this very simple basic Botania setup and I've already made the rune of air which is what I need. The rest of this is very simple actually. Let me just dip my tablet in here first because we are going to need some mana. Come on. Go in. That's it. Drink the mana. Why are you not drinking the mana? Now you drink the mana. It was shift, shift right click. Honestly, but you know one forgets. Oh, that was a, that's a tiny amount of mana. But actually, the rod of the skies, which is the thing that I am going to make, takes a very little mana. So let's come here. No, not here. Uh -huh. yeah, I'm gonna do all the Botania stuff mostly, well, maybe not all, but most of it off camera because I've done it so many times. But I really want to fly, so I hope you will uh, indulge me. There we have Rod of the Skies. And what this does, it doesn't really give us flight. It's just gonna lift us up and then let us down again. But. That is not so bad. Yeah, there is no horizontal movement. At least we can get a bit of a view of the place we're in. So obviously we need some kind of a glider and the best kind is dark armor. I mean, I might possibly go into additions armor, actually additions armor, because I heard it was pretty good, but I just love dark steel so much. And for this reason, we are going to need, well, to make a bit more dark steel. I do have six bits that I found in chests, but we need at least six more. Actually, more than six. A lot. Which is why I already made some obsidian. I sacrificed three diamonds for a diamond pickaxe. I'm using all vanilla tools because I haven't yet worked out the new Tinker's Constructs. But, yeah. Uh, we will need a power source and well I thought since I want to get into actually additions let's do an actually additions power source if you see what I mean I think we will need more iron though let's see so I want to just do a coal generator I think because really I don't have anything better I could do ah, there is an RF tools one as well a coal generator so we will need this sticks i think four iron four sticks very easy we have the sticks we have the iron and we have that yes thank you 
and let's see what was there there was some coal wasn't there that was also needed to make and must not forget the cobble there we go a coal generator furnace for coals now where should i put this setup hmm. oh i made a smeltery incidentally i think i might just set it up here and then do something better now the only thing i don't know is whether the coal generator is going to just whether it needs pipes or whether it's going to give things by contact let's see is this charging or oh. oh this is charging okay very good make us some coal do we have any more iron so, i was hoping for a full block but i guess we'll have to suffer through what we have um and obsidian and i think it's just a matter to wait for all of this to cook so i'm going to go offline momentarily and i'll be back when it is all ready yeah i just need some coal powder in here Okay, so we have made uh, an anvil. Let's put it here and let's see. Dark plate, dark wings. And the cost is actually much lower than it used to be. I'm sure it used to cost more to put things on the dark plate. So I approve. Let's exchange this one and let's temporarily stick it in here uh, and i think g yes glider active with the g key i had to let's put this here and let's try it out way flight ah this is fantastic I don't want to fly explore too much because let's see oh we've got three more people on the server so uh yeah <laughs> we don't want to lag them out too much but um uh, yep. this is fantastic oh and let's choose a nice place to live in i guess I'm not sure if I like this area so much, but uh, now it's very weird because I got some saplings, some uh, <laughs> slime saplings, and apparently they don't grow on normal ground dirt anymore. Somebody told me, I think it was Grok, I gave him one sapling and he told me, so you know what? Let's take a couple of those and let's break some of those. Uh, why must it be night? Why must it be night? Uh, never mind. We can we can fly. Oh, I, I should really hide the clouds. I wonder what this area is. It is quite flat and it might be nice to sort of live on top of of a mountain. Ah, oh, I don't know. I will decide later. But for now, I think I've been rambling enough for long enough. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you will enjoy the series. It should go faster than the old infinity. And hopefully I will see you in the next one.